All right, friends. So here is uh, the plan that we've got for dealing with the Heroic Lich King final phase. So um, this is after we've gone through the second transition. We still have the vials, the um, uh, spirits up, and we still have uh, uh, the Lich King. You know, people will be everywhere. We've now gone into Frostmourne. We've come back up. So uh, I expect it to be a little bit chaotic, but hopefully people will be mostly in the middle. Um, so, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to move the whole raid, including the boss, to one side. And in this this instance would be the left. I apologize for, for Gemma if you can hear her. I couldn't get her to stop doing this. So, uh, so you'll, we'll move the whole raid to the left. And this mark here in the center, this white thing, that's a frost trap. We're going to have a frost trap down every time. The Lich King should be brought over the frost trap to activate it. So, we're going to have the raid positioned at... I've got blue square marked here because I want to treat this like it's Vile Spirits. And I'm aware that we will not have the um, exterior portion of the platform to use. Um, but that's... I just wanted the map... I thought it might be easier to look at this way for size-wise. I'm aware we won't have that extra portion. So, I want people to be kind of in a straight line on the back so that the Vile Spirits are drawn in that direction. Now, you'll see here I've got um, one of our tanks uh, holding the Lich King. And the Lich King should be facing the interior of the platform. I've got another tank pushed off to the side, closer to where the spirits are. Uh, the spirits should all kind of be in the middle, and I've got a DK back here. So, the range of the explosions is five yards. It's only five yards. It's really short. So, and they're going to tell me this is a little bit of overkill, but as long as... So the DK here will be in frost presence, and they will be icy touching, and the paladin here will be taunting. And the idea is to bring these guys down. When they hit the frost drop, they'll start coming down because they'll be moving slower. This is representative of an army of the dead. We have four ways to collect them up. Three armies and one earth elemental. Uh, we're going to use it for the first four. Um, we have eight total immunities. We have six paladins and two magicians. And so that should be more than enough to get a complete immunity over it. If that doesn't work, if the immunity, you know, once your bubble runs out, I need you to run back to the raid and the tank will be handling them. The DK should not be uh, getting any of them. Um... To handle that, we'll have a complete rotation of the, the Jaw Sintragosa, which is one minute. We have two of those. Um, Aura Mastery, which is two minutes. We have four of those. And Divine Guardian, which is also two minutes. And we have um, four of those as well. Uh, so that should be enough. There will be a Team 1, which will have two Paladins, one tank, uh, you know, a, 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 a holy and a ret, and those together will make up the uh, group that does the cooldown rotation for each of those, for each of their sides. Um, and there'll be a team two that does the same thing. So we'll go back under. Now we're coming back out. We're going to go to the opposite side. Fresh frost trap. The same thing, but a new paladin assigned to bubble when the spirits come. A new DK assigned uh, for army when that comes. Um, and the same DK with icy touch, frost presence, spamming. And I think we should be able to rinse and repeat this. I actually think we won't need more than four. But if we do, that's okay. The last one will simply not be collected up. And we will use one of our um, other paladins that hasn't been assigned to bubble it yet. I would prefer if tanks didn't bubble it. Uh, so they'd have their cooldowns to be able to handle the um, Lich King. Um, and uh, that's it. I think this is going to work. So good luck, guys. I think we can do this. Can't wait. Rooting for everybody.